this now finished. I will attempt to pick this up so you can see it. It's the jobby thing for life. So it is very long, it goes all the way down to the so on me it touches the floor. Hey guys, so this is February's Craftiosity box. So I haven't opened it yet, so I don't know what's um, exactly in there, but obviously we do get to see hints and tips of what's coming um, when they release it each month, they show us. So I do know what's in there, but I haven't opened to actually see it all properly yet. So we're gonna open up and have a look. Ooh, hey, we gift. that some pretty tape creativity the Scandinavian way vivid great gain I think I don't know but it's masking tape isn't it pretty Ooh. that's not part of this it's just a little extra that's gone in possibly because of the slight miss up on last month I don't know but who cares so let's have a look I always try to undo this without ripping the paper, but I never manage it. Because so I do like to reuse the paper. Uh, let's not want that and all that. Okay. I'm a little bit this time. We're doing better, aren't we? So. Ooh, that's a pretty postcard. So it's our little info. And we got our actual postcards. All oh, these are really pretty. I love plants, so. Oh, look at that, the caps are going out. And then, that. so these are really lovely. So, this is our instructions as usual. So, we're making this beaded hanging shelf. So, we should have a copper ring, cotton yarn, nine small wooden beads, 17 medium wooden beads, five large wooden beads, a yarn needle, and a palm leaf tray. You'll also need scissors, ruler or tape, small piece of tape. Let's try that again, ruler or tape measure and a small piece of tape. So, let's have a look. So, we've got the needle. It is inside there, nice and um, protected, not sticking out any, which is quite cool. We've got a little cotton, so this is double knitting um, happy sad try that again. Sada Happy Cotton Double Knitting 20 grams, which is a pox 43 meters or 47 yards. So it's 100 percent cotton. So cute little ball, isn't it? <laughs> and here's our ring. Nice and simple. Okay, so these all the beads, they're in a sealed bag, so I won't open that up yet, but should we have a Good look at all of them. Some good sizes in there. We're really looking forward to making this one. And this is our tray. Isn't that nice? It's nice and light. I was wondering how heavy this would be. With, um, this is really nice. I guess that's because it's a palm leaf tray. Um, but isn't it pretty? So it's nice and rustic looking, which for a plant pot holder and things is what you want. So I think that's gorgeous. And then I think that's everything. Yep. So this is going to be really fun to make. Um, it looks like it's going to be reasonably simple, so it should be a quick video when we do make it. Um, but you can see. That's the thing we're making there, which I think is really pretty. I don't know if there's a bigger picture anyway. Oh, okay. So we'll fold it over and show you. That picture there. So this one. I don't actually have a square plant pot all the way around. So you might get a picture of it with a round plant pot instead of a square one until you get a square one. But 
I'm really looking forward to doing that. So do keep an eye out for in about a week the video of me making that. It'll be a time lapse video. Let's put these back in. Um, yeah, so all the usual legal jargon stuff, I pay for these myself, um, so all opinions are my own, um, but I do have a code from them for anyone else who is watching and is interested in getting one of their boxes, you can get 20% off your first box if you use my code, which is SJA. CG 2020, the Sonia Jones Arts, Crafts and Games 2020. So it's just the first letter of the name of my channel, really. Um, but I will have it linked up, displaying up here and in the description so you can click through if you want. Um, but yeah, I do recommend these. I do love them, that you have some really cool crafts in them, and I really enjoy making the stuff that you get in them. Um, I'm getting quite a collection of things now. <laughs> Um, but it's really cool. Um, so, I don't know. Mention in the comments what you think of this one and if you're looking forward to seeing the time lapse and the finished piece of this one. Um, I think my favourite so far is actually last month's one which was the notebook cover. I really enjoyed doing that. Um, but we'll see how this one goes. I'm looking forward to it. Now, um, I do love my plants so having somewhere nice to hang them would be really nice. Um, I might even be able to hang it from the frame of my um, photography set up here so that I can actually have some nice plant life next to me while I film which would be really pretty. Right. I will see you all later anyway. You all take care. Bye!